With the game releasing this I make some last minute changes to the balance, optimization, and the trailer. My name is Garrett, and welcome to episode 66 of Attila's Crap. Honestly, a good chunk of the development time this week has been just playing the game, trying to iron out any bugs, find any quirks, and also continue balancing the game. Thankfully, I haven't found too many bugs and the game seems pretty well balanced. I've just been making a few micro adjustments. It's kind of hard as the developer trying to play test and balance it because I have my own unique playstyle and knowing the ins and outs sometimes doesn't help in this case. So I'm relying on the demo feedback I got from a while back to carry me through. The only thing I really want to add to the game at this point is the ability to cancel research upgrades or marketing campaigns. For example, if you only have one researcher, it takes you like over a year to do a level three upgrade. And although you should probably be doing level one upgrades at that point, the player can misclick and I don't want to punish them for that. I tried adding the cancel button for both research and marketing. The code should be pretty similar, but I was having some trouble with it. So it is currently disabled. Now, to be fair, I didn't really <laughs> debug it that much, uh, but I'm hoping to get that in before release. If not, it's not a huge deal. I'll try my best. Additionally, I've spent time optimizing the game to the best of my ability. First, I started out by removing some unused files in the game just to save some space. I also found from playtesting on my laptop that it runs pretty well. It isn't that high spec, so it should be good to go for other devices. That being said, I should probably go back in the profile and give it another pass. Although after I watch Rao's video. Besides game development, one of my biggest passions is martial arts. I didn't go too hard this week, I basically just focus on the knowledge parts, redoing my forms and one steps, just making sure I remember everything. There have been some of the forms that I've been doing for over 15 years, but if you don't practice them enough, you forget, so I want to make sure I practice. Finally, I worked on a release trailer for the game, making a basic cut and recording a lot of gameplay. It's funny because I would record some gameplay, start editing, realize I missed a shot, go back, record more gameplay, start editing it, realize I missed a shot again, and then kind of repeat it a couple of times. I got a basic cut of the trailer done. I will probably post it in the Discord from some early feedback, but most of this upcoming week will be spent on the marketing distribution and the trailer for the game. So the time has finally come to release the game. The current plan that is going to be in pencil and paper is that I'm going to release the game May 7th, this Thursday. Now there's like a 99% chance that I will release it on Thursday, at the very least by the end of this week before the next devlog, but I don't want to set it firmly in stone. I'm giving myself a little bit of leeway because this week I actually have my finals for school and I have a, a few products I need to finish up as well, which that is going to take priority right now because releasing a game doesn't exactly help my GPA. So I need to get all that done first. Whenever it does inevitably come out in the next seven days, uh, I will post the release trailer. And whenever that comes out, obviously the game will be playable. Also, I really need to thank all of these people and more for helping me through this journey. Your comments and messages really mean the world to me. Like it's, it's awesome to, to look each week and see all your comments and see the positivity. And I honestly really love it. Um, it really mot motivates me to keep going and keep making these devlogs. And I am super appreciative uh, to get to know all of you guys, at least virtually. And I guess my tone of saying that, like I'm not done doing devlogs. I know this game is done, but I'm not done doing devlogs or YouTube. No way, like I'm on this long streak. Um, but uh, I really wanna thank you guys for that. And if you guys do end up playing the game, you may or may not get a worker with a very familiar name. Last thing I promise, uh, Pixel Mania has started. It started May the 1st. Here are the few of pieces I have made so far. Also, if you want to join or if you want to see everyone else's work, you can look in my Discord. Uh, there's information for Pixelmania there as well as a video I recently posted. Thank you all for watching. I want you to know that I love you, I care for you, and I am there for you. If you need anything at all, especially during these times, feel free to reach out to me. It is not a bother at all. I'm more than willing to help you guys out. Until next time, for me and the commanders, well, this actually might be the last time they say goodbye. Oh shoot, that's kind of sad. <laughs> well, I mean, there's still gonna be more devlogs, but this is gonna be the last one where we're still developing it, so. Dang. We'll see you in the next devlog for some more fun. Bye, everyone. <laughs>